Hey Taurus, this is your love reading for November 2017. All right, some of you guys are leaving things behind and not looking back whatsoever. It was in the reverse, but that's just the message that wants to come out. So whether you're leaving things in the past and you're moving forward, so whether this is something good or something bad happened in your past that you're just ready to move forward, some of you guys are going to let go of this person and just be over and done with it. Or you're going to move forward with this person. Okay, it could be an air sign. Uh, air sign. Well, it must be if I mentioned an air sign. A fire sign, Aries or Sag. And then we have the Hierophant. So yeah, some of you guys, it has to do with um, mar marriage, you know, community, you know, coming together. So yeah, I feel like a lot of you guys are just coming together as one. A lot of you guys are just ready for a um, for marriage. For marriage. For those who are not married, I feel like that's what you're looking for, forward to. Like you're done playing games. You just want to settle. All right. Okay. We have the Five of Swords. So, willing to change. Actually, no, not willing to change. That one actually has to do with, um, because oh, I'm pulling clarifiers now. Um, that has to do with working, working so hard and realizing that it's not what you expected. Does that make sense? So a lot of you guys are trying to rebuild that relationship and you're getting the same crap from the past that's what i'm getting the same the same bs from the past and some of you guys are ready again are ready to take the next step with somebody but you know they're taking you as a joke or i don't know somebody's just not like it's not that serious okay so on on top of the th three of wands is the hangman and the Queen of Cups, like, you're ready. You're ready, Taurus. You're ready to move forward, be in a relationship, be happy, you know, commitment, and just ready. But I also see a little bit of fear of what is out there or what's next. There's just a little part of you that there's fear, okay? All right, so yeah, some of you guys are still stressing out. It's like a, whether you're single, because there's, again, this is just love, whatever pops out. And it's not just for singles and couples. It just, it's for everybody, whoever it resonates with. Okay, so it's, it's behind your head that is it going to be too much if you start working again in that, in that, um, in your relationship, are things going to fall back? Are things going to go sour real quick again? Okay. And for those who are ready to commit, ready to be in a relationship, it is also in the back of your mind, like, are things going to go well this time? Is this person going to want to be with me for real? You know what I mean? Okay. So the world card in, in the reverse um yeah yeah some of you guys are are gonna be disappointed some of you guys are gonna feel very very disappointed and you're gonna just you're gonna shut down you're gonna shut down and it's gonna be like no i i just i don't see this working whether you're in a relationship or not it's gonna be too much for you it's gonna be like nah this is not what I signed up for. This is not what I deserve. No. All right. So I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, reading. If you did, give it a thumbs up. And remember, if you want to book a private reading, my website is in the description below. I have oils, candles, and things like that available on my website. Until then, take care.